The Department of Government Efficiency is attempting that, run by the richest person in the world, who, as of today or last week, is valued at $330 billion. I want you to understand how much money that is. So, if you take $330 billion and represent it by $100 bills, if you lay them end to end, how far will it go? It will go around the earth three times. Then with what's left over, you can sort of tape them together as a kind of a ribbon and ascend into the sky and into space and reach the moon. By then you would have used up all the $100 bills that comprise $330 billion. There's one bit of information. Another bit of information. If you fired all 3 million government employees, put them out of work, how much would you save? You can do the numbers on this. You would save 4.3% of the federal budget. That's all. So the government is spending money on something else that represents the bulk of what the federal budget is. Ask a bigger question. If you go and give these trims to all of these agencies, by the way, chainsaws are not good at trims. They're like for cutting down the middle. But anyhow, you give like a haircut. You cut one part of an agency here, you trim it there, nip tuck there. And then you say, we saved millions of dollars. So it sounds like a lot of money, but it's not. So to cherry pick the bits and pieces of one agency and another on the grounds that that's somehow gonna transform how the government operates, I think is a little short-sighted, a lot short-sighted. NASA, their plans to cut half of its science budget, including the removal of the office of the chief scientist. The chief scientist is the person who offers a vision for which way the science directorate is gonna go. There's astrophysics, there's planetary science, you have earth science, there's heliophysics, understanding the sun and space weather. When the sun has an explosion, you kind of want to know about that. High energy streams of particles head towards Earth and could take out our satellites, upon which so much of our modern civilization depends. There's also planetary exploration, and in there is the search for life. All of that is in the science mission directorate. So you want to cut that to save money? Um, how much money is that? How much is the total NASA budget compared to your tax dollar? It is less than four-tenths of 1% of your tax dollar.